What's up guys, it's your boy down this 815, checking in with another Diddy O. As you guys can tell by the title, that is right. I am doing the five things I like about this beast. Stay tuned, let's get to the vid. Let me turn on the light so you guys can see how aggressive this car look. Ready? Big difference, right? The first thing that I like about this beautiful car is that it's all black, it's blacked out. Let me walk around so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Blacked out everything I could on this car. The only thing that I did not black out on the Beast is um, black out the Chevy emblem. It's still gold. I'm gonna be changing that very soon. I'm actually gonna do that on my own. Walk around, give you guys a little nice little montage so you guys can see everything that's blacked out on this Beast. Let's go. On to the next. The second thing that I like about this car is aggressive stance that it have. Like, just look at it, guys. This car is extremely aggressive. Added the whole uh, Camaro body kit on it to give it that aggressive look. And if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, front splitter on at the bottom. That is this right here, guys. This is actually the bottom of the bumper, but this is the splitter that goes under this to make it look more aggressive. Like. I know you guys see that the bra is on, but that's what it looked like. And make the front of the bumper look more bigger and more aggressive, especially coming towards you. Everybody always tell me how aggressive my car looks when I come down the street, especially if I have the lights on just like this. I can see we poppin', yeah. Also, wait a minute, wait a minute. Make sure you guys follow the Instagram. Here you guys go. American Authority side skirts right there. That is right, the American Authority side skirts. To give it that aggressive look, most people just put on the front splitter and they don't put on the side skirts. I just feel like the front splitter with the side skirt and especially the big wing in the back, it just all fits with the car, especially with the Camaro because it got a lot of curves and looks to it. So that's what I like about that. You guys know I also added the spoiler on the back. That is not stock. That's not a, the factory one that came on the car. I changed that. Um, this is the ZL1 wing. I wish I would've got the SS wing because it would've just fit better with this car. Um, the ZL1 is more wider, more bigger, so it just fits better with the ZL1, but it doesn't look bad. It doesn't look bad. The third thing that I like about this car is the Lamborghini lights. You guys see it. People would be like, how, did you, how can you just how can you just put Lambo lights on a Camaro? Um, these are uh, made and specifically built for this car. At nighttime, it just looks so aggressive, guys. It really do. Um, a lot of people tell me how beautiful that looks, especially at nighttime. I see them lights very often, but it's a different look on a car. I think anybody got that except for one person, which is CJ on 32s. It is another guy, um, but I don't see him that much, but I will be changing those very soon. About this car is that this car is actually very good on gas. I do have a straight pipe on my car. Um, I still have my secondary cats. Obviously, it drinks more gas than the factory exhaust setup. I really drive this car. I only bring it out when I want to have fun with it or I got a car show or a car meet to go to. Or if I'm just linking up with Swervo. But that is right, guys. I do not daily drive this car. In the case, I want to get rid of it. I don't know. I just know that. I've taken care of my car and that my car is in very good shape. The thing that I like about this car is the overall touches that Chevy did on this car, guys. Like, I don't think there is no other V6 out there that has, like, better touches and better finishes than the Camaro have. Chevy has really outdid themselves with the overall look in the inside. This look like some, uh, it gave you a jet feeling. As you guys can tell, I can change the temperature just by turning this. I know a lot of people say they don't like it to give them a different feel, but I personally like this whole overall thing that they did with this car. It shows on the radio and right here, you actually, um, change on how low or how high you actually want the air to come out and it just got some nice features right there the air in this car overall is really good um it's really good guys so yeah i just like to finish the touches i right, just check out the steering wheel like this just give you the race feel it also got the paddle shifters right here um downshift upshift like this is this is beautiful you got touches right here we'll turn the volume up and down right here as you guys can see right here on the radio you can also change the music i believe by just hitting 
one of these right here you could change the music by hitting these right here or right here you know you got your cruise control whatnot i'm getting off topic but yes guys um yeah i just really like the interior in this car is just it's, it's beautiful say that is my five, top five things that i like about the car without the aggressive look that it has the lamborghini lights um it's very good on gas guys and the interior in here even though i have the base model it still looks very clean and it looks very good and as you guys can tell and as you guys can see i still have this in here so if any passengers come sit in my seat um my rug won't get dirty and messed up and i also have that still in the glove compartment like it was when it came and it still kind of have the new car smell in here i really do take care of this car guys um i got this in 2018 i got 13,000 on it i'm shocked that i have this many miles because i really don't drive the car that much hope you guys like the video this is my top five if you like the video make sure you leave a like make sure you subscribe make sure you share to put my videos out there but most importantly like like i just said because it helps the youtube algorithm and yes guys that will put push my videos out there and by me being a smaller youtuber you know it would help me grow and i really appreciate you guys for doing that till next video guys peace